Hey everybody, it's Diana at Catherine Diana Studios, and as promised on my Instagram post, um, I made these and I was going to do a video, and in the video, I think what we can do is a craft with me kind of thing, and, um, and kind of show you up close, maybe a little bit more, what I made out of book page. So it's book page, washi tape, this is a Tim Holtz sticker, or uh, label. And some decoupage napkins and all these napkins are used i sell these on my etsy site it's katherine diana art so um and if you see a napkin something that you don't see in a set send me a message because i've got extras i can customize a set for you and just you know send you three of the same um individual napkins or whatever you know so anyway but here we go so great little um faux envelopes um i could sew them or glue them if you don't have a sewing machine. I have one, but I don't like to sew very much. So I'm just not very good at it. Um, good at it means I'm good. Um, and uh, anyway, so you can just draw a little stitch, you know, lines. Or um, I actually have some stamps. They're buried under my desk here somewhere that look like stitches. So I've got like a zigzag and a straight stitch and there's another stitch but i don't remember what it is but anyway so just some cute little stuff leftover lace um you know these little flowers you know these things that you get at the craft store so there's one in blue i uh, did one here with uh, and this is all paper napkin here too and a vintage stamp some of a um, cloth napkin and some miscellaneous cloth and i'll probably line each of these with some coffee dyed paper so they become a journaling space and that helps reinforce the paper too so did in that color and we've got some purple here with a little um flat back crystal vintage stamp well i don't think it's that old but a stamp and this is from a tim holtz um label collection ephemera pack palette is that it i don't know anyway it's that one can you see that i think there's a little glare there on the lights let me try that so there we go so anyway i just um i didn't use all of it i just cut part of it off and took it there and then there was a little bit that i needed to trim off the top and so what well, really wasn't the top it's the middle of it and so i used them there and there's a little bit of a background a little weight there so there's that one, and paper napkin, and one of the little flowers. And kind of the same thing here. And this time I cut the stamp in half. There's a piece of washi tape holding this down because it kept flipping up when I was trying to take photos. So I just have a little washi tape there. But I cut the stamp in half so that it would just open like so. And it's a French stamp with an Ottawa, Canada postmark. And a um, little bit of um, fringe here. And then in yellow, some lovely Australian stamps. And if I can find, where is it? There it is. <laughs> I had to take off the, there were three in a row. And I took off the third one. Uh, because just as where the postmark is, you know the old Groucho Marx um, type fit, funny glasses with the big eyebrows and the big nose um, that you put on? Well, just as... <laughs> It was so silly, just where the postmark hit right on the queen's face, it kind of gave that look. Can you see that? Like I do, I see that. And I'm like, okay, that doesn't look right. And it's so silly. But anyway, there you go. So she's wearing her Groucho Marx glasses and funny nose. So there you go. Um, anyway, um, so I just did this. Um, this is some Tim Holtz, you know, the paper and the rolls that he has, and some vintage stamps, and some bits of lace, some flowers, and some um, paper napkin. Oops, same here. Um, and there's another piece of washi tape holding that down. And this has some stickers on it. And, um, oh, that's from, never mind. This is from an order from, uh, I think, Red Lead Stamps, and it's... Um, R-E-D-L-E-A-D stamps, I think it is. So anyway, so what I thought we'd do is we'll do a little, um, I gotta take off my jacket here, it's getting hot in here. It's kind of warm where I live. Um, I thought we'd do, like make two. Let's make two and kind of show you how I did it. And you can do this with 
some miscellaneous papers. Let me get this here um, and move that. Uh, miscellaneous papers, um, copy paper, any kind of paper that you have around that maybe you've used some cheap water. You can go to Dollar Tree and get watercolor paints and just paint up your paper to get color. Um, and obviously Dollar Tree for glitter, anything like that to add a little bit of color. I do stuff like that. Um, I don't have any in front of me, but um, uh, Joey at um, Joy De Fee, um, she gets big pieces of brown craft paper and you can buy that brown uh, rolled uh, craft paper or wrapping paper at Dollar Tree as well and um, she crinkles it up and then paints over it with some color and maybe adds some glittery paint or whatever and then tears them up and use them uses them and I've, I've got other stuff I've got photos on my Instagram that shows that but anyway so um I don't know which way I'm going or what I'm doing I've got all my supplies kind of all around here can you see kind of that way and this way and let's see what we can now watch I won't be able to get it back you can see me sitting on my I have a bar stool in here so I kind of sit on my knees when I'm doing videos because it's not this is up really high this is a high table that I work on so all right so let's see what we can come up with we'll move this little picture of the queen there Hard to believe she's been gone a year, isn't it? It'll be September. Um, and I, um, it was so sad. Such a lovely lady and kind, gracious. Uh, and I lived in the UK for a while, so, um, you know, it has an impact on you. So, anyway, all right, so let's get to this. So, I think what I'm going to do, and all I did was tear out some book page, and then I just cut it. Um, and folded like it's going to be an envelope here and I'm kind of thinking that I might do some fabric along with maybe some of the Tim Holtz labels and you know what where'd I where'd I put that napkin I just saw I think I want to use this I've got some butterflies here some um I got these at Michael's, some Recollections Butterflies. Can you see those? So let's give these a whirl. I really don't know what I'm doing, so we'll just kind of wing it. Um, let's see. I could maybe do kind of like that there a little bit. So let's, let's take a little bit of that. And what I've been doing on a lot of these is going over the... Oops. I don't really want to lose that flower. Well, hello. Um, I've been going over the um, the back a little bit, or the the fold here, just to give it a little bit more of a you know um, reinforcement to help it out. So let me grab this one. This one here, and I better make sure I've got enough glue sticks nearby. I don't know how much is left in this one, so. Oops, I've got little fuzzies and things from working on other things. Um, I think what I'm going to do is just go around kind of, oops, more the edges a little bit and I can reinforce them. Of course, now it's stuck to my finger and I think what I'm going to do here, hey, 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 get off of my hand. Thank you. Is um, put more of it on this. This is a whole lot easier become a little more aggressive with and get enough glue on there to have it hold than it is on the napkin so let's try this see what we get and you know because you're doing it live basically I mean you're making a video oh there went my other piece I'll get that in a second oh this is where all the mistakes are going to happen you know how it goes isn't that Murphy's Law or whatever Alright, let's try, oh my goodness, I've got lots of glue on my fingers. Let me try and get that over that side and give that a little reinforcement there. And most likely this part here is going to end up um, staple or clipped inside of a journal or maybe even attached. I'm not really sure. Um, I think what I'm going to do here is maybe add um, maybe a big postage stamp, a piece of lace or something, and I'll cover up that hard edge. Or you still can go in with, um, you know, another little piece 
Uh, maybe. I've done it before and it actually works out, which is kind of surprising how it can. Um, and even if the edges don't match, they seem to just kind of blend together. Or if they don't, you barely notice any of it. Oh, let's see now, look at that right there. So I can put that like basically like so. Maybe I have it over it a little bit, but I don't think anybody's really going to notice. Well, you are, because you just saw me do that. Let me try that. Oh, I like that so much better. And I'm going to do it this way. Hey, hey, hey. I've got a fan blowing behind me, so it's moving this napkin around. Let me get that. Get back there. There we go. Boy, I got a lot of glue on that. I'm hoping I'm doing this where you can see it. And we'll do a little bit over here. Or not. Maybe there was enough glue on there. I didn't think so. Must be. I don't know. We'll see. Okay, so we got that. And everything's sticking. So I want to get maybe like a, a, I don't know. Maybe a blue. What's in here? Oh, that's interesting. Maybe this label here. I got these at Joanne um, Fabrics a couple of weeks ago. They had all their Tim Holtz stuff was um, half off. Ooh, did I just find it? I think this is it. Let's see if it's the right blue. Might be. Or close enough. You know, you can always just add whatever. Um, anyway, it was all uh, half off. So it made these packs something like... $3.50 or $4, something like that. They weren't expensive at all. Um, and you can always use pieces of book page. Make your own thing. You can... Um, those are okay. Um, see how that's kind of like a little bit in the same hue, the same kind of family? Um, and... Um, or you can use magazines or old stamps or make your gift wrap. You know, oh, there's so much stuff. So much stuff you can use. You don't have to go out and buy all the th all the things, you know. So um, I think I'm going to do a piece of lace here. Where did that big chunk? Um, I believe this came off of a roll. I'm pretty sure that it was something I got at Hobby Lobby. I think. I don't know. I don't really recall. Now this one's too short. But that doesn't mean I can't take another piece and just toss it on there. So let's get... Do I want this over or under? I think I want it over it. So I think... What the heck? I can just tear this. It doesn't matter if the lace is going to be across. I like this glue. This is the clear gel tacky glue, but at the same time, I get a little frustrated with it because if you're not careful, before it dries and becomes tacky, unlike, you know, like the normal tacky glue, the original stuff, you know, this you can move a little bit, but it doesn't tend to like slide and move around. This stuff does, so you have to watch it because where you place something may not be where it ended up if you're not paying attention and watching, so... I think I'm going to do this here. I'll probably, I may put a postage stamp here or maybe put it on this end. So I'm going to try and get that down and do a little bit of this here. Come on, let's go. I don't know which way was right with this and I don't think it really matters, honestly. I'll go this way? No. Let's go the thinner side, I guess. Ooh, look at that. Just made it. Don't have to cut any off. I kind of pull that down a little bit. All right. So instead of that one, let's find a postage stamp, of which I have many, many bags full. Someone was on Facebook Marketplace and selling just a 
bunch of old, old stamps, and I bought about 10 bags, because I have a stamp collection from when I was a kid, and I use stamps out of there sometimes, but most of them I don't want to use because they're, they have no value at all, but they're just really pretty, and I can't find any just like them. They're from countries that don't exist anymore, and that's probably why I can't find them, because they are pretty. They're beautiful butterflies and whatnot, and, and um, well, that could be really nice, maybe. Oops, doctor. So, I don't know. No. No, 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 no. That's a pretty green. That's kind of in there. And these have different countries, and for the most part, most of them are Australia, Canada, and Great Britain, or England, rather. Um, but there's a few that are a little bit different. Some from Finland and France and a few other places. Let's try. I'm gonna, you know, because I'm gonna reinforce that back half. I can just cut this, and I want to tear this one so I don't have such a clean edge. And let's see, I think I'm going to rely more on the shape of this and put the glue here instead. Because some of these napkins are pretty thin and it's not easy working the glue. Oops, I gotta go lower so I've got some room on the back. Um, it's not easy putting the glue, come on, down on them, you know? So, all right, I'll go back and kind of reinforce that a little bit. Oops. Alrighty, and let's see what we can come up with here that might match nicely. See if I'm, and you know, I don't have to have it all the way across, you never do, but maybe a smaller bit. Mm. Sometimes just another tiny little piece, I don't know. You know, you know when you start playing with what you're doing and you could do something like that. Yeah, why not? It's fine. Sometimes I have them across, sometimes I don't. Let me set that there, it's a little more stable. And let's get this guy here. And cut off that edge. Alrighty. Oh, that's cute. Okay, so um, that kind of is a little more purple, whereas this one's a little more blue. I think I might stick with just this. And I could leave this on in the background. But there's a, those are too much alike. Now that would bring some balance here. If I went with a different color here, I mean, I could, do, I don't know. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I might just put a, put a flower or something. Do I want to put this one here? Maybe. Let's try this bit of paper. What is this? I don't know. Oh, it's like a payment stamp. Hmm, I don't think I want to take that apart. Hang on. I've got some Dollar Tree paper. It is a little bit bright. But we can always tone it down, or leave it bright, but you can tone it down with some Distress ink. Sometimes. What have we got here? Um, where's my little lid for this? There we go. Let's see what we can do. I'm not really trying for any particular... Hey, quit. 
no particular patterns or anything. This is still too green, it's, but pops, that's for sure. I mean, that's kind of the same family of color, you know what I mean? You know what I mean, jelly bean? I think I don't want it shaped like a stop sign. What is that, octagon, I think, shape? You know, I could stamp this with some words or an image. What have I got? I am willing to bet I have something right here. Because, you know, I usually do. Or maybe I, like, did the right thing and put stuff away. Why would I do that? <laughs> what would compel me to do that? Um, let me see what I've got. Um, where are those stamps? Where are those stamps? No crud, of course, because I'm looking for them. I can't find them. Ah, there's this. This will work. Tina from Shabby Dabby Doodah, I believe it is, has a big version of this stamp, and I couldn't find one, so I bought the dinky version, which is really cute. So let's try this and get a little, woo, a little bit of color on there, tone that down, let's try maybe that, with this, yeah, that's all right. Uh, you know what? I'm just going to go ahead and use this. Is that right? Come on. Hello. There we go. Oh, mercy. Kind of sometimes move them around, kind of smear that glue under there. And we'll get this. Move my finger. Mm, yeah, I'm gonna leave it over there, I guess. Is that straight? Oh, mercy sakes. Let's try that again. Try not to have crooked things or things on an angle behind you when you're working. And if you can, Take a minute to stand up and look, because when you're looking at it this way, it's so easy to put things on incorrectly. I hate that, but it happens. Okay, let's do, maybe, just, how about just a butterfly? I don't know. I don't want too much weight over here, so I might be able to do a butterfly over there. Do I like that? I think this needs something, so I may just stick in some washi tape or something totally different. I don't know. Do I like that? I can't really see it. I got something to pop. Goodness, even I can't see that. The glare's so bad. Let's try that. Nope, too much of the same color. You can see that. Those colors are in there. Hmm. Maybe. Oh, that's something stuck on my finger. Let's give her a whirl. Will she fit? Yeah. You know what? I'm just going to stick it down. Maybe some uh, <clears throat> paper or... You know, this green is in here. I could do... A snippet of the fabric. I could do. Nope. That color is almost the same. I don't know what I can get out of this. Let's see if I can get anything out of it. I 
maybe something like that with where my little flowers go. Oh. Oh. They're here. They couldn't have gone far. Because you all saw me. They're probably right in front of my head and I can't see them. Ugh. Let me move these guys. So we don't need those in the way. And we don't need this in the way, or that, or this. Ah, there we are. Da, 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 da. Let's move some stuff out of the way here. I think this kind of gets a little bit lost on that. Don't you? Kind of looks like it, doesn't it? Um, there is kind of a... Oops. A pale blue flower that's normally in here. It's like a cornflower color, and I don't think I have any more. I think I used the last one on one of the how you doings here. So I could go with, well, I could go with green. If I go with green, it's going to probably get lost on that. So if I do that, maybe we can do... There's some papers from that Timu haul that I did. Remember the video? Did you all see that? Let me try a piece of this. I think this was like $2 or something. Something like that. Um, that's not quite the right end. Boy, it's close, but no. No cigar. It's not quite the right blue. What have we got here? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Well, come on, find something. Yeah. I mean, not yeah, I love the papers, but it's not working. Ooh. This is gift wrap, and I cut out the butterflies. But who says I can't use some of this blue right here? Right? Right. That would be a nice little pop. Hey, stop that. Oh, I have so much stuff on my fingers. I could also just put a um, beige flower. I think it might get a little bit lost. I don't know. This isn't really my style. It's okay. It's not zapping me. I prefer something to zap me just a tiny bit. All right, Diana, come up with something. There's a lot of weight. There's just something just missing here. Hmm. I don't want to do another... You know what? This is what I'm going to do. I'm going to do another label here. And I'm going to put one there. And I think that'll do it. Let's see. Come on. Goodness. Try to move that little goober down. There we go. Alright, I don't want to see the white on that. I'm still seeing it. Alright, so let's put a little bit of... There we go. Can't even tell, huh? You can put that here or possibly incorporate it there too. Mm. I don't like it like it, but we might be able to do something with it. Do I want? Eh, I think lower is fine. Let's see. What color flower? We got something. Does this actually match this? Gosh, all these fuzzies on my gluey fingers. No, no. I mean, it's kind of in the same family a little bit. I've got some bows as well. I'm going to move 
move my fan down a little. It's probably going to blow some things around, but it's kind of hot. That's a nice little pop there. Yeah, it works. It's good enough. I'm, I'm good with it. I'm trying to get out of my usual creative style. So, um, I don't know, is that the same, same color? I think that's a little bit brighter. Um, so that I'm, you know, expanding my horizons a little bit because I, you know, we all have a particular style that we tend to just kind of stick with. But I've been trying to get around that and do other things inspired by other artists. And um, I don't know if I want another one there or not. So I wanted to dig that guy out because that is the one that matches. Get in there, y'all. With all this glue all over my hands. I need to get a baby wipe. Take care of that. I'll go ahead and do one here. So this blue is kind of pulling out on another blue in here a little bit. And these blues are pulling out the other. So, you know, that's okay. That's not bad. So here we go. So there's that one. Let's do another one. Let's do one more. Um, where's the lid to this? You know, it's probably right where I... I'm probably looking right at it. Eh, there it is. Alright, so let's try one more. And I have that other little page. I want to do pink, I think. Because I haven't, I haven't done a pink one in a while. And I'm just thinking about using this piece of fabric here. I grabbed it. This stuff is so thick, you can't really tear it. It doesn't tear very well. But it's so pretty. I really like this piece here. So, let's try, I'm going to try and tear it again. Yeah, it's really, it's really tough to tear. Let me try this way. Oh, that one's all right. Ah, won't go. Okay, um... Where'd that other little piece of book page go? Can't go far. So, oh, that's right, it went on the floor. Hold on, let me get off my chair here. Yikes! <laughs> Try not to fall over. Because I'm on my knees on a bar stool and that's not the best way to be. <clears throat> I can end up oh, toppling over. Okay. Let's see what this can do. How about some fabric across the top? Yeah, that's pretty far up. And I don't have to have this quite so long. It's probably not straight. Eh, maybe it is. That's really a heavy fabric. I think I want it quite so heavy. So let's go a little bit lighter and see if I can tear this in a smaller strip. Maybe. Uh oh, you may hear the dogs start barking. My husband's feeding them right now. It's their dinner time. And I told him I'm gonna go run and make a video really quick because I'm behind. And, um, I'm still in here. Let's see if this will tear. Ah, good. All right. Oh, goodness. Sometimes these things are so hard to get off of there.
Then you can always come back and trim off those little bits. All right, we might do something long this way. I've got pink napkins. I've got, well, that doesn't quite match, but you know, all kinds of little bits and pieces and pages and even, even this hot pink Dollar Tree paper. A little, oops, fix that. A strip of that against that or near it, you know. Let's see what we can get. Just think outside the box and actually don't think. Try not to think. Just go. That's another thing I'm working on, which is why sometimes I struggle a little bit because I like to plan things out. Um, and um, winging it when you're trying to make something look really pretty. You know how you think out designing your room or putting an outfit together or something like that. So, um... That's kind of how I tend to go. And so when I'm here saying, don't think, just go, it messes with me. <laughs> just, I'm like, that's not my normal. I can't do that. So let's try maybe this. I don't know. I don't know where I'm going with this. And I'm hating it already, but we'll see. <laughs> well, I'm not hating it, but... It's not zapping me. But I, you know, we always manage to pull something out of our hat and that looks okay. So, yeah, go with it. See where we get. I'm kind of scanning my desk for bits and pieces of things. I don't think that's quite the right style. I love the paper though. Ooh, I love that side. It picks up on that. That's kind of nice. Let's do it. Oh, mercy. That is some thick paper. Uh, this is probably something like K and Company paper or something, and theirs is always so nice and thick and heavy duty. Let's try that, maybe. I'm not going to go quite all the way over. All right, this one here, I'm going to do a little bit of a better job here. You know, you can always go back, like I mentioned earlier, and fix your edges with glue or glue stick or something. And I think what I'm going to do on this is I'm going to put some really nice big flowers in the corners here. Maybe a little bit of lace um, bits in the back. Lace bits. You know what? I've got some pretty little pink flowers over here. It has some pretty little um, flat back crystals on them. So let's see what we can get out of this. All right. What if I did that? Did one here. I like the broken, you know, the holes here. That's kind of nice. Although that has a big space there, so I think I might do a more solid background there. I don't know. We'll see. Let's just do it. Just do it. Keep rolling and keep going until it looks good. Just like when you're fiddling with your hair or a scarf or your tie or whatever. Oops. To make things look just right. All right, I need to get a um, wipe here. Hold on, my fingers have got so much glue on them that I'm not going to be able to touch anything here in a second. Oh, goodness. one here and a bigger one on this end bring some weight on the bottom because that's that's heavy there and I think I'm gonna try and find some pinks in here maybe see that gets kind of lost there doesn't it so 
Let's try, there's a hot pink here. I don't think I want the hot pink. Mm. La, 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 la. And the white will get lost. Well, let's think here. Or not. Let me try one other thing. Let's grab a couple of these little guys. I want the glittery ones. I don't know if I got it. There, we'll get good, 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 good. See, that does kind of get lost in there, but it does, but it doesn't. I'm going to stick it on there because if I need to add something else, I can. You can always, you can tuck in fibers, you can throw in a piece of paper, you can, you know, lift these things up and add all kinds of stuff. Um, even bring, you know, little flowers like down here. I may do that on this side or something, I don't know. I might do that one like that. You can kind of see it a little bit. And sometimes you can take one of these, cut it in half, stick it in behind somewhere. You know, there's all kinds of places you can tuck in all kinds of stuff. All right. So this is fine. Three over here is good. That's good. All right. So let's do this. And I may use this paper again. However, da, 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 I might do more of this. Oh, looky there. Maybe I'll turn it that way. And we can just cut it down. I can end up with a little... It seems kind of weird having it solid. I'm so used to having patterns and, and napkins behind that are kind of transparent. Not quite so thick and heavy. I hear Gizmo, one of the dogs. We're babysitting him while his mama is away in an exchange program overseas. Um, so he's going to be with us for a while and um, in her college exchange program. And um, he's super fussy when it's time to eat. He starts whining and having a fit and pacing the floors and you know, because we don't feed them, <laughs> apparently, enough. Or, um, you know, I'm going to move this down so I can fold that over on that edge. You know, or give them enough treats, because, you know, that's what they get all day long. Well, not quite all day long, but they get a lot of treats. First thing in the morning, before breakfast, you know. Everybody gets some treats. You come down and have you know, a little bit of toast or something and give them one of their little peanut butter treats or something. All right, I can do, let's see this here. I might do two or not. Let's see. I don't know if I'm going to do two or not. Woo! How about... What if... What else do I have up here? I've got the fabric. So let's, we can bring the fabric back in to balance this out. I think I had another piece of it floating around. Here it is. You know, I can do three little strips. I can alternate. You can go, you know, like so. Do another flower there. I don't know what I'm going to do. I'm taking this right now. I'm going to tear it or not. I think what I'm going to do is go like this. Maybe, maybe, maybe. We'll see. Hey, it's sticking to my fingers. 
So I'm not trying to actually move that. I am now, but I wasn't. So let's try that. I stopped sticking. I think I'm gonna try a big piece of um, some of the lace here. Let me cut that a little bit smaller. And how about a big postage stamp or a sticker? I'm gonna have better luck finding a sticker. Where are those? Um, there they are. Is there anything with pink? No, there's one right there. So let's see if we can find that. And there's the Barky Dogs. Where is it? Where is it? Where are you? Oh, look, I think that's it. Maybe. There it is. Oops. So I can possibly take a bit of this. It's got postage stamps on it. It's one of the, you know, those, it's not something you see. I'm not even sure if we've ever did this in the States, honestly. I have them from Europe, real ones, where people made payments and they use post, these, they're like postage stamps to indicate that they've been paid. And I have some from the um, uh, 1800s and some from the early 19, you know, like 1920s, stuff like that. All right, so I can possibly do something like that. I think that gets lost behind this. So it becomes almost, you can see it there, but the second I do that, you don't really see it anymore. Kind of, kind of boring. So let's flip it around and see what we get. Um, try that. Roughly, I don't really like it quite like that, but let me move that. I don't want those even. And do like so, and let me grab the flowers again. I need to go get more of these flowers. They're on sale this week, and so I need to just go grab them. Let's do one of those, and one of the little shiny ones. I think I had one, but I don't know where it is. And let's do another. I'm going to match this little corner right here. So let me find another pink like that one. I think it's that pink right there. And I don't see, and that one might be one right here. Come here. Let's take a look. Yeah, that's close enough. All right, so I think I'm going to go with this, and I might put a little, couple little stamps. Maybe I'll do some, maybe some pink something on that. I don't know. We'll see. All right, let's see what we've got here. I'm going to put that down. I should probably use... The glue stick for this. You know what? I'm gonna, 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 gonna. With that, get this out of the way. Scoot over there, mister. Oh, come on. There we go. Yikes. All right. I'll try that one there. You know, now that I did that, I need this because this is fabric. And I've got some fabric tack, but um, the uh, has this ever happened to you? It, it the top split, and so glue just started leaking everywhere. And you know that stuff isn't cheap, so. I was disappointed, I didn't know it had, so a lot of it had come out of the bottle, and then once it had, um, it was upside down, and you know, I put them in these, well, this isn't one, but smaller one of these, and hold them upside down so I'm ready to use them, and it was split here, and I didn't know, and so as it was upside down, it was just pouring in, and until it finally dried, um, even though the cap was on it, it, it 
it leaked out a bunch from that split. So I, needless to say, I wasn't, I was not a happy camper. So, um, so I'm not using it right now. I'm going to go ahead and, no, I'm not. Let's do with this. So it must have been some strange manufacturing defect or something, or perhaps it was dropped and had a weak spot at some point, either at the store or during shipment or something, because it really was a problem. So, all right, let's see what we got here. And you know, you all can put more um, glue on. I don't put on a lot when I'm doing my videos just because it takes longer and you know we typically none of us really has that much time oh i forgot to put this on hello none of us typically has a whole lot of time to watch you know an hour-long video although this one i think is going to be an hour-long video um but um it's hard to do that so wherever i can cut some corners and time i try to do that that's got too much glue on it oh my goodness it sure does it's really coming out now, so i got to be careful with that. Woo! And, you know, on this part here, you could stick little, um, little leaves out, you know, either in pink or a complementary color. You could pull some of that, well, the purple I cut off, um, but in pink or glittery or in green, you know, it would be fine. It would look really cute. And this would be cute stamped with, you know... Oh, excuse me, with distress ink, this is probably stuck, oh good it's not, um, with distress ink in the background, um, maybe some words or something, you know, there's all kinds of things, I don't know, that's cute as is, but it almost seems like it could use something else, doesn't it, I don't know, I think it's alright, or I could use, you know what, these are kind of just this round shape, let's see what it does, I'm going to kind of make it look like a little closure thing, maybe. Ooh, that doesn't look very good, does it? No. Do I want it that way? I don't know which is the right way. What if I did that? Yeah, what if I didn't do that? Ooh, mercy. Um, since we've already got already got um you know what the heck i'm just gonna go with it because i'm gonna put a flat back crystal on there and um which end did i have i want the point there we go i think that's about center it's not quite is that about right let me take a better look i've got time to move it around since this stuff here does gives you t the time I think that's about center. It's pretty darn close. All right, let me grab a little crystal. Let me see why I put those. You could put a crystal, a pearl, a button, all kinds of stuff. I've got a pearl here. You put another flower too. Um, it's a medal. You know what I don't have here? Just whoop. see how it looks before I grab a crystal. Oh, and this one's missing a crystal. Well, how do you like them apples? Well, that's all right. I suppose I could use it. It's just not going to look the same. Or not use it because I can't get it out of the package. Mercy sakes. Come on. Could do something like that. That might be a little too much. Um, too many of the pink flowers. Where are my little crystals? Oh, gosh. You know, you have them right in front of your head. Right in your face. And then you go to find them. And, you know, where are they? I don't know. They should be. I just had them. Well, here's some. These have anything pink? They have some pink. They're kind of big, but that's okay. The others are too small. So maybe the bigger ones will be just about right. Put a little glue on this. Oof. 
Yikes. All right. Good enough. Good enough. Good enough. Okay, so there's that one. Ta -da. Can you see it? I don't even see all this mess is what you see. Let me try and move that in. And I hope that you got to see everything I was doing. So there's this one. Let me grab something that has a better background. A little bit neater and cleaner. How about that? That works a little bit better. And, um, of course, we have these that you've already seen and that we worked on. So those were a lot of fun to do. I just came in here and just went. You know, I'm like, let's just go. Turn off my mind and just go. And then, of course, that one there. So... There we go. Can you see them? Is it up? Let me see if it's not up. I don't think it's up high enough. So, there we go. So, anyway, I um, hope you all have a great day. Have fun crafting. And remember, just grab your miscellaneous stuff. Junk mail. Um, envelopes from, you know, your junk mail. Your ev everything that you can think of. Um... You know that's just lazing around um <laughs> lazing around laying around magazine pieces whatever you don't have to necessarily have all these and you can make your own butterflies and cut them out and pull them out of magazines or print them off too you know um and cut them out and then you can make all kinds of little whatnots so there you go so i hope you all have a great day have a great week i'll probably do another video later this week it's as a matter of fact i know i'm doing one thursday because i have a drawing for the Christmas um, paper bag journal giveaway and um, that one will be on Thursday and I'll probably do another one maybe Friday or Saturday. So anyway, have a great week and we'll see you soon. Take care. Bye-bye.